Hello everyone, I am Eric Merritt from HomeSmart Realty and I'm going to talk about the importance of why a home warranty is very important because I had a situation that personally happened to me in my own house on December 2nd of 2019 where I, my house was 58 degrees downstairs and I didn't know what the heck was going on. I had it on heat, cold air was coming out and it dawned on me that I need to call ASAP Air Conditioning because they don't charge anything for service calls. So they came out and figured out that the AC, the AC compressor outside was okay, the heat pump was fine, that whoever changed the thermostat programmed it to cool only, not to heat and cool. So that's why it was only 58 degrees downstairs instead of 70 degrees, which is why, what I set it at. So I got very lucky and I don't have a home warranty on my house but I will very shortly and so it's kind of embarrassing to be a realtor and not have a, a home warranty on your own home. So this is why I wanted to make this video and then I had two other buyers that also had no heat right after they bought their house. So my inspector Rob Sells, we're going to talk about why it's so important to have a home warranty and have a good home inspection on your home before you buy it and a home warranty as well. So the part about uh, what Rob Sells and I are going to talk about will be in, done in another video, but I'm going to go into the home warranty companies. There are seven home warranty companies that I'm going to talk about, but I'm going to talk about four first and then break it up because seven's too many to talk about. For now and so I'm going to do four in the first video and three in the next. So here's AHG of it's a home warranty company based right here in Arizona Mesa. The standard plan this is some of the bullet points there's eight questions that I asked each of the home warranty companies what their basic plan costs what their premium plan costs and then some of them have a plan that's a little higher than the premium called the ultimate or the platinum. There's two companies that have that. Then I asked, well, how much is their service call for if you want to call for the service charge for them to come out, have an inspector and their approved list to come out? How much it is to add the pool, a saltwater pool or a chlorine DE grid pool? How much is it for a spa? Uh, I have that in some of them. And then how much is a HVAC. So if you have problems with your AC compressor, how much is it to, how much coverage will they give you aggregately for the policy term? And then also, how much will they give you for pool equipment that fails, like a pool pump or DE grid filter or anything that's related to the pool? Those those questions are our hot buttons in Arizona as HVAC, air, con, air AC compressors, and pool equipment tend to go out, especially when it gets hot, because when it gets hot, compressors can be very expensive. They can be $5,000 or more, depending on the type of compressor that you have. And pool equipment can also, since it's running, since there's high, high amounts of evaporation, that also will play a role into it. So, um, and then the other part is, what do they like a salt water pool what will they pay for that and then what will they pay for a chlorine some of most of them are the same some of them are a little bit higher for a salt water pool if they if a salt water pool has trouble so those are the different questions that i ask each of the home warranty companies at their corporate offices so ahd their standard plan is 375 the standard plans on all these home warranties, so I don't repeat the same thing over and over again, do not include the kitchen refrigerator, washer, and dryer. $375 for that. The Guardian plan, which is right here, at $525 does include the three above items. So it does include the kitchen refrigerator, washer, and dryer. If you have a casita or a house with over 5,000 square feet, then there is a $160 option upgrade. A pool that has a DE filter with grids, meaning a chlorine pool is 160 extra. Saltwater pools are 200 extra. A spa is 160 dollars extra in case a like the the electrical grid goes out on a spa, which happened to myself. 
After a home warranty is purchased and a home warranty is obtained if the HVAC goes bad, it's free replacement in the first year. After renewal at the end of the first year to nine years, there's no aggregate limit. From 10 to 17 years, it's $5,000 aggregate. And after 17 years, there's $1,200 aggregate limit. I believe this is on the age of the AC unit, not the age of the house, but you may want to check AHG home warranty to be sure. I'm pretty sure it's based on the age of the house, so, or, or it could be on the age of the AC unit as well. So chlorine squall or up to a thousand dollars in repairs during contract term. Saltwater pools are capped at twelve hundred dollars. So here's the link to AHG. Okay, I just wanted to show you the link to that. Okay, so the next company has choice home warranty. Basic plan is four hundred twenty dollars. The ultimate does include kitchen, refrigerator, washer and dryer at five fifty. Service calls are sixty-five dollars. Add one hundred and sixty dollars for a pool and its equipment. First service call cannot be added to the cost of the home warranty. HVAC coverage maximum is five thousand dollars if an AC compressor goes out. Pool and spa equipment aggregate per contract are fifteen hundred dollars. Well, that's a pretty good plan right there. Uh, here is the link to it once here for choice home warranty. So you can see that. Okay, now we're going to Home Warranty of America. Basic plan is $390. Their premium plan called the Diamond Plan does cover kitchen, refrigerated, wash and dryer is $535. Service call is $65. Add $220 for a full spa with a chlorine DE filter. $370 for a salt water pool. First service call cannot be added to the cost of the home warranty. HVAC has an aggregate limit of $5,000 in case it goes bad or needs to be replaced. Pool and spa equipment are up to $1,000 per contract term period. And here is the link to... Oh, whoops, I went too far. Here is the link to Home Warranty of America. Okay, there's the link to it. And Platinum Home Warranty will be the last one covered on this video. Platinum Home Warranty, their basic plan now is $479 a year. Does not include kitchen, refrigerator, washer, and dryer. Their premium plan is called the Gold Plan, which is $779 and includes one free AC or heat checkup and includes refrigerator, washer, and dryer. Kitchen refrigerator, that is. A DE filter chlorine pool at, or salt water pool is $179 extra, which turns it into a $958 home warranty if you want kitchen, refrigerator, washer and dryer and the gold plan as well as the pool. If HVAC needs replacement, there is an aggregate up to $2,000 of coverage. Chlorine pool or spa detach has up to $1,500 for repairs during contract term. Salt water pools are capped at $1,500 per term in repairs for Platinum Home Warranty. The link for a Platinum Home Warranty is right here. So you can see the prices right there. And then you have the link right into this presentation. So I'm going to jump ahead to the table I have right here. Here is the table. Here is the table between AHG, Choice, Home Warranty of America, and Platinum. So this is the basic premium ultimate plan if there is an ultimate, which these four do not have. Top plan is $705 with AHG, $730, $755, and $958 with Platinum. The service call is $65 across the board. Add chlorine pools, 180, normally 180, 180, 220, 179. Add for saltwater pool, 200, 180, 370 for companies that H. Home Warranty of America, Platinum is 179. For HVAC, there's no limit 
with H AHG. Now for what I said before, one year it's up to one year it's free replacement, one to nine years it's no aggregate limit, nine to seventeen years it's five thousand dollars, and seventeen years and up it's twelve hundred dollars. Uh, five thousand dollars for a choice home warranty, five thousand for home warranty of America, and two thousand for platinum home warranty. Full coverage is pretty even. A thousand for chlorine on the AHG or twelve hundred for the saltwater pool and fifteen hundred for both choice home warranty and platinum, a thousand dollars for home warranty of America. So this table here will make it easier to identify the differences between these four plants. Now in the next video with the other three remaining plants, Fidelity, Old Republic, and First American Home Warranty, there will be at the table as well, and I'll talk about those three. So anyway, if you have any questions about these home warranties, please give me a call at 480-999-6061, and I've done my quite a bit of research on this so anyway wanted to tell you about this because I think it's very important to invest in a home warranty but please do your own due diligence because these companies can change their pricing and their policies at any time. Anyway thank you for watching. Please subscribe.